Hi children have a good day welcome to grade 4 max class today we are going to start a new chapter chapter 10 and the topic is mathematical expression today we are going to discuss what is meant by mathematical expressions when we express a sentence mathematically it is called a mathematical expression in other words we can say when we express a sentence mathematically it represents a mathematical expression look at the sentence sum of 1 and 3 so we know what is meant by sum sum means addition so sum of 1 and 3 can be written as 1 plus 3 so if you are writing in sentence we write as sum of 1 and 3 likewise in mathematical expression it is 1 addition symbol 3 next difference between 5 and 3 so difference means subtraction so 5 minus 3 5 times 3 5 times 3 means 5 into 3 half of 12 half so we are going to divide so half of 12 So twelve divided by two. Total of seven and three. So total. So total means sum. So sum means addition symbol. So seven plus three. Take away four from seven. Take away. We are going to take away. So subtract. So larger number minus smaller number. So seven minus four. So the numbers in mathematical expression separated by positive or negative sign are called terms of expression. So by using the sentence, we can write the mathematical expression. If they have given the mathematical expression, you can change it into sentence format. Next, order of operation. So what is meant by order of operation? when there is more than one operation involved in a mathematical expression it must be solved by using the correct order of operation that is dmas d m a s a mathematical expression contains numbers with different operations now let us see an example look at the example the yellow colored box 5 12 Into eight plus thirty divided by six plus eight minus five. Look at the question. There are different operations like addition, subtraction, division. Everything is given. So now we have to use a standard rule for solving such kind of questions because subtraction is also given, addition, multiplication, division. so we use the standard rule that is dmas you can remember by saying disney movies are superb disney movies are superb so you can remember by this code word d m a s so d stands for division m stands for multiplication a stands for addition and last s stands for subtraction so first you have to divide then multiply then add and last you have to subtract so this is the standard rule now let us discuss mathematical expression with addition and subtraction look at the example 6 plus 5 minus 3 plus 2 so 6 plus 5 minus 3 plus 2 we know the standard rule what is the rule dm as so in this question addition and subtraction a and s so we know a comes first addition comes first next subtraction so first you have to arrange the addition numbers see the addition numbers 6 plus 5 next minus 3 so we move to the last so plus 2 comes forward so 6 plus 5 plus 2 first addition then subtraction minus 3 first add the addition term 6 plus 5 11 11 plus 3 sorry 11 plus 2 13 next 13 minus 3 we subtract answer 
Look at the second example. 3 minus 2 plus 8 minus 2. First addition term. So plus 8 comes forward. So 3 plus 8 minus 2 minus 2. 3 plus 8 11. 11 minus 2 minus 2. 11 minus 2 9. 9 minus 2 7. So in this two question what you understood. First you have to arrange the addition. Next is subtraction. So today we have discussed what is meant by mathematical expression and how to solve mathematical expression with addition and subtraction. Do practice on 1 and 2 in your concept book page number 131 to 133. Also do question number 1 to 7 in your workbook page number 5 to 7. Complete your homework on time and hand in Google Classroom app grade 4 maths. Thank you children.